Prince William and Prince Harry explain the last phone call they had with Princess Diana. Princess Diana died in a tragic car accident while in Paris, France, on August 31, 1997. Her untimely death came as a shock to the royal family and to the world. Her sons, Princes William and Harry, were 15 and 12 years old respectively when they lost their mother. Now, more than 20 years later, the princes have opened up about the last phone call they had with their mother. Princess Diana's fatal car accident At the time of her death, Princess Diana had been vacationing with her boyfriend, Dottie Fade, in Paris, France. They left their hotel and got into an awaiting Mercedes S280 driven by Henri Paul. Fade and Princess Diana were in the car along with their bodyguard, Trevor Reese Jones. In the Pont de l'Alma tunnel, Paul lost control of the Mercedes and crashed. The accident killed Paul and Fade while Princess Diana and Reese Jones were taken to a hospital. Princess Diana died but Reese Jones survived. Where were Prince William and Prince Harry when their mother died? Princess Diana's sons were on vacation in Scotland when she passed away, according to Reader's Digest. Last phone call with Princess Diana. The boys were vacationing in Scotland while their mom spent time in France with Fade. Even though they were in two different countries, Princess Diana spoke with her children on the phone. At the time of their phone call, Prince Harry and Prince William recall being very excited about playing with their cousins. Harry and I were in a desperate rush to say goodbye, you know, see you later, Prince William said in the documentary film, Diana, our mother, her life and legacy. Had he known the fate of his mother, the phone call would have gone very differently, Prince William said. If I'd known now what was going to happen, I wouldn't have been so blasé about it, Prince William said in an interview for the film. But that phone call sticks in my mind quite heavily. And for Prince Harry, the last phone call with his mother is something he still grapples with today. Looking back on it now, it's incredibly hard. I'll have to sort of deal with it for the rest of my life, Prince Harry said. How differently that conversation could have panned out if I'd had even the slightest inkling her life was going to be taken that night. Prince William tells his kids about Granny Diana. While their mother has been gone since 1997, the boys keep her in their thoughts. One of the many ways they do that is by talking about her with family. Prince William talks about his mother with his own children, Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis, at bedtime, calling her Granny Diana. While Prince Harry doesn't have children of his own quite yet, his wife, Meghan Markle is due any day now with their first child. He's been keeping his mother's memory alive in other ways. For instance, Prince Harry proposed to Markle with a ring made up of two diamonds from his mother's personal collection and a stone he sourced from Botswana.